Good morning. This is your headless piano teacher again with a free lesson on walk on up. This is called the walk on up technique and it's very simple. Uh, in chord progressions, as you know, chords have a tendency to want to move up a fourth constantly. In other words, the C chord wants to, it, particularly if you put a seventh with it, it wants to move up a fourth to F. And the F chord wants to move up to B flat really talking about the circle of force here or the circle of keys but that happens all the time in music what what usually follows D seventh almost always G what follows G seventh almost always C so we can take advantage of that by walking up between chords uh, for example if I'm walking up from the uh, C chord say to the F chord <clears throat> I can walk up in tens and it gives a real nice secure sound like that. Now some people hands are big enough to play that and if yours, your hands are then do it. With, I, I can't do that so I have to cheat. I have to use two hands. I have to use... See my right hand is playing the tenth above it. Okay so that's all there is to a walk up. You just walk up like so. If we're in the key of F it would be... Now we're going to throw a little uh, curve curveball here. We're going to use what we learned last week. That is the four of the four uh, tech uh, technique. So let's walk up to four. But before we play the F chord, let's play the B flat chord, and that immediately gives it a little bluesy sound. Let's do it in F. After you put sevenths in there get a bluesier sound okay now let me let me put this in context by doing it in an actual song let's say you're playing amazing grace okay uh, you can do this on any song of course but let's say let, let me just play it that's F to B flat and back to F and so on okay now watch this right hand has to help. Okay, but before we play B flat, what are we going to do? Play the four of the four. Now in context. So instead of going to C, I went to the four of the four. What's four of the four? It's B flat. So I play the B flat chord and then just came down. Now on this walk up, I played triple. I tripletized it. I went triple, triple, triple. See that? My left hand's just walking up in octaves, but my right hand. You can't see my bottom finger. That's okay. You and I'm, in the right hand, I'm tripletizing it. Triple, 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 four, four, one, four, one. Four, four, one. You see that? And you can do it with all kinds of all kinds of voicing. You don't need to you don't need to do it just like I did it. Uh, voicing is not the subject here, we're talking about chord progression. So, uh, that's it for this time. Practice hard. See you next time. 
And if you want more tips like this, and if you're not already signed up for our newsletter, come on over to playpiano.com, and I'll send you a newsletter like this every three days or so. So thanks for being with me. See you later. Bye-bye for now. Hi, this is Dwayne again, and I'd like to tell you about a little book that I wrote a few years back. It's called Piano Chords and Chord Progressions, The Secret Backdoor to Exciting Piano Playing. And it's a terrific resource about chords. If you want to know more about chords, uh, you ought to latch onto this book. It's just barely over 10 bucks, 11 bucks, I think it is. And uh, it covers all the chords and chord progressions that uh, I talk about in my videos. It's just a great... Uh, it's, it, it's not a substitute for videos, of course, but uh, or DVDs, but it's a great summary, and it's so uh, inexpensive that it's well worth your while to get. Here's a table of contents. You can just look down here and see all the things it covers. It starts out with major, minor, diminished, augmented, sixth, seventh, and on to thirteenth chords and suspensions and alterations, and then gets on to chord progressions, and so on. So, it's a very, a very thorough book, and uh, it's got a lot of, a lot of illustrations. I'll just toggle through a little bit, so you can, and there's the back cover. So it's worth your while to get. So hope you take advantage of that. Thank you. Bye-bye for now.